lifting. We're gonna have a, a major, major job of raking everything up. A lot of pine needles, branches, just a lot of stuff that the trees have fallen down. Getting out into the garden again. Jordan, you think there's any carrots in here? Jordan, what are we gonna do out here? Dig carrots. Dig carrots. Yeah, unfortunately, it got cold, snowed on us last winter, or early in the fall, and I didn't get my carrots covered. I was thinking they're just wasted or whatever we didn't eat. And so we're gonna go out here and see if they survived. I'm thinking they probably did because we had a lot of snow. We had probably two feet of snow when it got really cold, like 20, mid 20 below zero, or when it was like 35, 37 below zero. So we're gonna see what we can find. I looked and looked all winter for that shovel. I knew it was out here somewhere, but I didn't know where. So somewhere underneath here, about from the greenhouse out, there should be carrots. Look at that, we got carrots in here. Big old carrot too. Look at that. Yeah. That, do we have to dig more? Well, we want a couple more heat, don't we? Yeah, it's gonna be another week or so probably before the snow melts. amazing we put a lot of mulch on here and a lot of compost so they're not sitting they're not completely just soaked so they're not they're not like sitting in in the mud they're sitting up in a drier a little bit drier than it would if we had not put any compost down so i was thinking we have a pretty good chance of them surviving Jordan, do you want to eat one? I don't, I don't like carrots, Dad. Here, eat one. This is your size. Dad, I don't like carrots. Very crisp, very sweet. Sweet? I mm -hmm. like sweet. You know I like sweet, Dad. Yep. 
It's generally about a sweet one, but I don't want a big one, Dad. I don't want a big one, Dad. I don't want a big one. Where can I eat that piece? But I don't know. No. Gordon, do you know what happened here? Do you remember? There was a deer last summer that was coming in here eating our tomatoes. I put up these pieces of wood so it couldn't get in here. Here. Is there anything growing? Any weeds coming up? Yep, see it? there's a green one there. Oh, can I pull it out? Uh, wait, are these a rash growing? No, not yet. Oh. Looks like Spud was in here digging a hole again. Uh, yeah. yeah, we're gonna have to come in here and get this all cleaned up. It's probably 65 degrees in here. It's warm enough that I think we could uh, probably plant some radishes and some lettuce and some early sup in here. It's March 23. It's been a long winter. Dad. I think the last video we did on this would have been in October sometime. Dad. End of October. So we haven't showed anything here in the greenhouse for uh, almost five months. And we've, we've had snow on the ground for five months. It snowed the last week in October. And I'm going to say maybe a third of our yard is now melted off. The rest of it is still under snow. Jordan, I'll bet you the rabbits would like it here. Can we throw one in there? Okay. I don't know that. Let's see if we can find a rabbit. They're not very tame. Here, let's see what we got for eggs. Dad, this. Some eggs. Hold the hat. Hold the hat. Hold it. Just hold the hat. I'm going to hold that egg. You can't. You're holding, hold it till I get done to see if there's any more over here. Now she wants one. Uh, now you just. Then, oh, that the goat's going to get out, maybe. And I think we'll clean the rest of those in the house. I mean, they're not the top few. The tops might be froze. These are scarlet nantes. I like these because they kind of grow more evenly, not so pie shaped, and they don't have that hard core. They're kind of the same all the way through. Super, super sweet with all the cold they've had.